Hello everybody, welcome to my channel and today's video. It's an update video for you today and it is the December Rocker Box update. Um, I have managed to find my little card that tells me everything that's on here. So we shall start with what was the Hero product in December and that was the Steve Laurent Lip Gloss. Um, we could have got this in two shades and I got it in the shade Cafe. The other one was Peaches. Now, I've had to, I've actually popped a little bit on uh, just before filming, just to remind myself what I thought of this product. Because I've literally, I think I've used it once in a, um, in a makeup product review video where I used all the Rockbox um, makeup products that we'd received over de December and January, I think it was. Um, yeah, I'm not a gloss person. I do like the pigmentation of this. It's not as sheer as a normal lip gloss. It's not overly sticky either, um, but it is a little sticky and obviously you do get transfer. It doesn't dry down. Um, the shade as well, the cafe shade for me, is a little bit on the pale side to be perfectly honest. Um, if you, I don't even know what sort of shade who this would suit. Maybe if you're somebody who likes a very, very, very sort of no makeup makeup look, um, then you would probably like this. But for me, no. Um, I do like Steve Laurent products. Like I say, I think the product itself is actually very nice. The shade is too pale um, and it's just not my sort of product because I'm not a, a gloss girl. I do like um, liquid matte lipsticks and, and my preference is actually metallic liquid lipsticks. So, yeah. But it was nice to have it in there and to try it. Steve Laurent is quite a high-end uh, makeup brand, so it was lovely to get it. The next product on the list I actually haven't got with me. It's the Philip Kingsley Bodybuilding Weightless Shampoo. It was a 60ml travel size tube that we received and that is actually up in um, my, one of my boxes upstairs in my holiday box um, because I'm going to go take that away when I, we go away for my sister's wedding soon. So yeah, so that's in there ready for that. So, can't give you an update on that and how I thought, unfortunately, but never mind. <laughs> the next product on the list. This is the Dr. Botanicals um, Pomegranate Superfood Regenerating Sleep Mask. This is 30ml, it's a full size, and it's worth £12. Now, this I am using, and this I really, really like. Um, it's a lovely... I'll just squeeze a small amount on it's got a very wide open nozzle and you literally need a tiny tiny amount the smell of this reminds me of another moisturizer i think it's like the Philoga one um that we had i really really like this it absorbs really really quickly um you get a little bit of sort of stickiness uh, on the surface of the skin, but it only lasts for about five, 10 minutes and then it is fully absorbed. Um, it leaves your skin really, really soft and smooth. And to be honest, for the price point, this is potentially a product that I would consider repurchasing. Um, funnily enough, I'm filming this in February and this particular product is part of the Latest in Beauty edit for the month of March. So I might just get another one in there um, because I really do like this. It is very, very nice. Next product on the list, this was the Bow or Bowie um, Lash Oil that we received. This is a 10ml bottle and it's worth £19.99. Now then, I have tried this. I tried this for about two weeks. Um, it's It comes, it's a little pipette and you literally, oops, oh, I've just dribbled that on my table. I was literally putting one drop like that on my finger, rubbing it in and then massaging it into my eyelashes and I was doing that on a night time. 
I didn't particularly, the only thing I found with it, um, or a benefit with it, was that I didn't seem to be losing my eyelashes as quickly. So if I'm not shedding them as quickly, then my eyelashes are going to appear fuller because they're not thinning out as much. However, the oil itself, I just couldn't get on with. I did not like the feeling of it on my eyes um, because obviously you're putting it on your lashes and then, you know, by sheer physics and chemistry, you're then going to get it on your eyelids and under your eyes and I just didn't like it. I, d I didn't like it at all. So I did use it for a couple of weeks and then I was like, nah, not for me, not for me. Um, but anyway, there we go. <laughs> and the next item in the box uh, was the Luna by Luna single eyeshadow that we got and this is in the shade Celeste. This is a lovely, lovely eyeshadow. It's worth £12.86. It says it's a gold eyeshadow, um, but I find it more of a brown, bronzy colour. There we go. Again, I did use this in the makeup look uh, using the Rockbox products. I'll just give you a finger swatch and then on the back of my hand. There we go, it glides on beautifully, it's really nice and soft, it's got a great, great amount of payoff. Um, it is a bronzy goldy colour, absolutely stunning, really, really nice. You don't need to spray this either to get this sort of look out of the shadow. Um, pop it on top of a, a glitter glue and my goodness me, you know it's there, you know what I mean? Um, very, very impressed by that eyeshadow and Luna by Luna again is a make if we were to get more of these in subscription boxes I, I would not be unhappy I, I really like that and then the bonus little um, treat I suppose that we had was this it was Yeti and the Fox and it was basically supposed to be like a hangover cure um, you got three capsules you had to take I think it was two before you went out and won when you got back and it was supposed to help with your hangover. Um, I've no idea. I've no idea whether it did or it didn't, to be perfectly honest. Um, the night that I was going out where I trialled these, A, I didn't get that drunk and B, um, yeah, I don't know. It was a bit of fun, um, but whether or not it, I just felt I can only do when I wake up. So, there we go. And that was everything. That was all the items in December's rock box and my thoughts and feelings on them all. Um, I'd definitely get the Dr. Botanicals uh, sleeping mask again. I'd definitely get another one of the eyeshadows. They were my, they were my two, yeah, awesome products. The Steve Laurent gloss, no. The oil, no. Um, would I buy these things? No. You know, what's wrong with just paracetamol? But anyway, it was nice to try the new products. Uh, that's my thoughts and feelings. Let me know yours down in the comments section down below. If you did enjoy the video, please give me a thumbs up. If you are new to my channel, the warmest of welcomes. Um, if you'd like to go and check out some of my other content, I will be popping a couple of options up here for you shortly. I don't just do these updates, I do all sorts subscription box unboxings, makeup looks, so please go and check it out. And if you, again, if you do like what you see, hit that subscribe button either down here or by the circle with my face in it, which is going to appear here shortly. Uh, thank you for watching. As always, enjoy the rest of your day and I shall see you in the next one. Bye.